All right, Jeff Zambello, Commodore Zambello. We're going to start off with the cock dribble water saving faucet. Now, we're going to see what awaits us here at the Royal Hibachi Buffet. This is the official, I, yeah, it's the official Pagan Christmas uh, 2018 uh, lunch buffet show. Royal Hibachi Grill and Buffet, uh, Route 46 West, Satterbrook, New Jersey. Oh, look what I see. Commodore Zambello. I see succulent duck. And before I go uh, record some, um, um, what do you call it? Mongolian barbecue action, I better grab it while it lasts. Gotta grab this sucker. Oh yeah. I would like to give a shout out to Bishop Brian, the Exorcist Bishop, as seen on the Travel Channel's hit show Ghost Adventure. I know he likes duck. And here's some succulent, succulent pieces of very meaty duck. This duck was out of luck, but fortunately I am in luck because I got plenty of it. So what a wonderful surf and turf I will start off with. All right, look at that, beautiful. Now, now I will see if there's any Mongolian barber. Oh, I, I missed all the action. I missed it because I had to go get the duck. Oh my God. Codfish, mussels with clams and marinara. Codfish. Oh wow, they got a whole cot. Oh, look at that. They got covers now. That's good. That is very good. Very sanitary. Barbecued lamb ribs are back. I'm going to get some, you know what, I'm going to have to go on the other side. I'm going to get some cod because this is a special catch of the day. It's catch of the day. Yeah, look at that. It's like, like they put a, put a whole codfish out there here at the uh, Royal Apache Buffet. Look at that. Suck it. Oh, there's some unruly, undisciplined child screaming right now. Oh, boy. Oh, Krampus. Where are you, my hero, when we need you the most this holiday season? There we go. Surf and turf, succulent duck with, with fresh codfish right up the bone. See that? Right off the bone, Royal Hibachi, coming at you, baby. Royal Hibachi. Buffet. Think I have enough codfish? What do you think? What do you think, uh, Bishop Brian, Exorcist Bishop? Do I have enough surf and turf? Succulent duck with some codfish? I, I did dedicate last week's show the WWE, well, former WWE superstar and cruiserweight uh, champion Enzo Amore, uh, because he calls himself Muscles Marinara, but he did not uh, reply to me because I ate a ton of Muscles Marinara last week, but he said nothing. Nothing, absolutely nothing. Here, as you can see, there is shrimp, uh, calamari, northern uh, black mussels in marinara sauce. Uh, I think I hear the old Mongolian barbecue dude. I think I hear some action going on. Yes. I got some in my plate. I got succulent meaty duck with bacala. Look at that. Nice big pieces of, of codfish. Of bacala. Over here we got 
We got uh, chicken, shrimp, broccoli, uh, lo mein noodles, uh, a few, some pieces of baby corn. This is part one of the Vapors of Life Mongolian barbecue. Look at that! Look at those beautiful! Look at that beautiful steam! Look at that! The Vapors of Life. Enough to wake the dead. Enough to wake any any uh, 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 mummy from ancient Egypt. Look at that beautiful sight. Actually, look at my beautiful surf and turf site. All right, jabroni. Look at that. Look at that. The undisputed king of all Mongolian barbecue. This is Christmas uh, week, pagan Christmas actually. I, I celebrate uh, winter solstice Yule, Festivus for the rest of us, and Krampus is my hero. Krampus is my mentor. But let's just call it Pagan Christmas 2018 because this week is, believe it or not, uh, Pagan Christmas Eve. And we have the king of Mongolian barbecue. Here at the Royal Hibachi Buffet, Route 46 West, Saddlebrook, New Jersey. Oh, the aroma of all that garlic. Oh, the hot sauce. Oh, the soy sauce. go with some finished product for these kids that probably need a visit from Krampus. Oh, what? What happened? Uh oh. Oh no, now he's putting now he's putting the chicken and the shrimp on top of there, on top of the lo mein noodles. Look at that. Oh, there he goes. He's done now. Thank you. Alright, now we have a, a second plate. We have the second plate coming up for the Mongolian barbecue. Right now we got shrimp, broccoli, chicken breast, and some lo mein noodles. Alright, he's cutting up the chicken breast, adding some soy sauce. Uh, lots of garlic. I can smell the wonderful garlic. That's it. All right, it's time for me to get my lemons because I got all that codfish with my lovely surf and turf. That's right, color coordination of the bowl. Surf and turf. Succulent meaty duck. See, look what they did with the ice cream station. They removed, there was some kind of shelving in the back of the hard ice cream that had all the bowls. Now they got the bowls on the side. I don't know what happened. Maybe, maybe some miniature Chris Christie child broke the uh, shelf. But they gave that high turnover rate chocolate ice cream is there and vanilla. All right. Put together a little jungle fever between the both of them and uh, all right here we got the uh, grilled broccoli and squish squash a combination of zucchini and uh, yellow I think they call it yellow crook neck squash speaking of crook neck that's a that's a perfect vegetable for the people doing seminars for physical fitness yep. look at that Fresh pineapple, kiwi fruit. <clears throat> wow, look at that chocolate cake over there. We got pumpkin pie, dessert table. What are these? Uh, they're not lychee fruits. They're either kumquats or loquats or medium quats or some kind of quat. All right, here we go. Lemons. Oh, the lemons. 
the ancient health food, both in the juice and in the skin, in the rind. Okay. I wonder if there's, I'm sure there's a lemon liqueur that is made in uh, the Mediterranean area. Yeah, I'm gonna need extra lemons with that cod. Between that and my lemon water. Look at that, beautiful. All right, you know, let me go to the seat. My damn food is probably cold. Oh, I need a steak knife. I need a freaking steak knife, man. Now I gotta go look, a, hopefully I got a steak knife. Available. Here, here's another trip I'm gonna make. And then my succulent duck and codfish is, are gonna get cold. Hey, they decided to put out enough steak knives. Look at that, beautiful. Beautiful. All right. Totally disgustipated by uh, the parking outside because it is pagan holiday. Took me forever to get a parking spot. Okay, there you go. Bird's eye view with a lemon. Gonna make my lemon water. Here we go. Here's my surf and turf. Hey, Commodore. Commodore Jeff Sambello. Um, look who I have sitting next to me. Okay, round two. I have here... Um, combination of um, regular either yellowfin or bluefin tuna that is braised on the outside white tuna shrimp and creole sauce I got flounder fillet wrapped in the shrimp I mean a shrimp wrapped in flounder fillet and I took this it had such a nice wonderful uh, aroma I'm not sure if it's beef or lamb, but I'll find out. With some nice roasted um, onions and peppers. All right, I got one underneath here. Really has a nice smell to it. Um, and uh, I was going to get a lamb rib, but I am so greased out from the succulent meaty duck, from the roast duck, that I don't know. Maybe, I don't know. Maybe I'll, I'll try one later. Let me take care of this first. <laughs> See what's going on here. The, the buffalo wings are covered, that which is nice. Um, fried shrimp. Tostones, platanos maduros. Uh, got the... Uh, Flounder, fried flounder fillet. I'm glad to see these lovely covers on everything. Oh, there's the tostones. I'm sorry. The other one was um, okay. That's the tostones. I'm not sure what they are, but oh, chicken nuggets. I'm sorry, chicken nuggets. No, maybe I'll take one. Um, they seem pretty stiff. I think I'm gonna pass. They must have mixed a little too much Viagra with the um, green plantains. A little stiff. Anything new here? Mm, not really. And the ice cream. Ice cream. Of course, the kids that need. Um, visits from Krampus are, are there. All right. Okay, before my dessert of this happy, uh, or should I say, um, Merry Pagan Christmas a week, 2018, before I get my ice cream from the hard ice cream station, we will, uh, video a little more Mongolian barbecue action the vapors of life 
and uh, I think here we just we don't have much really this person wants chicken breasts a lot of it with onions I don't even know why I'm taking a video of this because it's really only chicken breasts and onions guy over there is making making sushi rolls as you can see using the bamboo wrap commonly used to make the maki which is a, a Japanese word I believe for rolls as you can see he's an expert and he's probably he's gonna slice them oh he's not gonna show me ah uh, bafangu but anyway um, there's really nothing to see I don't even know why I'm... Yeah, the hell with it. All right. There yeah, the snow crab came out. Shrimp with the heads. Shrimp with the heads on them. For those that want to get a head start. Let's see what we got here. Here we got the uh, whiting. Peasant food, uh, in my opinion. Uh, stuffed clams. Actually, in a scallop show, uh, we got some uh, broiled salmon fillet. I didn't have any mussels marinara. Maybe I'll get some of that before the ice cream. What do you think, people? Are well, we having a, a big business meeting among waitresses? The the uh, the, uh, the Vulcan mind meld over there. Oh, hey, lo and behold, there's a big spoon. How about that? This way I won't get yelled at. Hey, the mussels marinara. There we go. Uh, I'm telling you, it's got some calamari in there. No cock dribble this time. No cock dribble this time, Commodore Jeff Zambello. I don't know. Hopefully we can do an invigorating live show. Over on the uh, International Brotherhood of Polyvans. Right. These people, the forces of evil, the forces of greed, need to be corrected constantly. They need to be reminded on how much of a scallywag they really are and they really are scallywags hey you got some some quahogs or no no ch uh, cherry stone cherry stone clams there <laughs> nothing like the the northern black mussel nothing like it in my opinion you know your jabronis, nothing like it. I'm so those scallywags doing the fitness seminars really need to be corrected. They really need discipline. Spandex or no spandex? All right, here we go. Stuffed myself before. Okay, this is a, this is a lovely scene. I know there's calamari in there, but I, I prefer the tentacles as opposed to the body. There's also shrimp in there, but I ate enough shrimp already. What's going on over here? Oh, the same thing as before. Okay. Oh, look how dark it's getting outside. Every damn weekend, every damn weekend it rains all day and night for the whole entire weekend. Every time I go out for my recreation for the weekend, it rains. What kind of a pattern is forming here? It's got to be climate change. Here's some uh, grilled asparagus. I could have one or two. Even though my urine will stink to high heavens. 
Why do they say stink the high heavens? I don't think anyone in heaven really wants people with smelly, with, you know, smelly uh, um, negative odors. What do you think, Commodore Jeff Zambo? Uh, here's your Arabic rice. Outstanding. But I'm not in the mood for bloating white rice. But I highly recommend it to anyone who comes here. It has a wonderful aroma and flavor. And there's pieces of lamb inside. And slivered almonds, as you can see on top. Slivered almonds. All right, let me return. And after this broth of the sea, I will partake in some hard ice cream. And then there's the hard, the hard ice cream station. Right. And hopefully, these fatty arbuckles, these kids did not leave the door open and uh, allow it to get soft. And I, uh, by the condensation and shine on the chocolate ice cream, I have a feeling they did that. Really, uh, Krampus, where are you when we need you? Where are you? Where are you, my hero? These, these millennials and children of the 21st century really need the severe discipline of Krampus. These people are eyeballing me. I feel like smack the people behind me. I feel like I feel like going over there and knocking their asses out, I swear. There you go. Zupa Zupa de Peches or Okay. Time for this fatty arbuckle uh, hard ice cream. Oh, what is that, churros? Look like churros to me. Yeah, how about that? Oops. It slipped right out of my hand. Oh, go ahead. Not bad, but it's frozen. Yeah. Yeah, so anyway, while I'm waiting, it looks like churros. I could be wrong, though. We got some baguettes over there. Baguettes and maybe, maybe some sort of garlic bread. Wow, you got a lot of variety going there. Right. You know what? That's it? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. I'm gonna use the spoon. Yes. Spoons is over there. <laughs> okay, here we go. Uh, well, let's put it this way. Not not necessarily hard, but not necessarily too soft either. Oh, look at that. I wonder if those LED lights have always been there. Gotta love LED lights. You know? Those beautiful lamps from Turkey. Look at that. Look at that, ponies. All right, all right. I was telling Commodore Jeff Zambello, the only thing brown I really like is is chocolate and uh, and wood. Forget about chocolate diamonds. Who the hell wants diamonds that that are brown? The crooks are trying to sell them as chocolate diamonds. What a bunch of thieves! Uh, all right, all right, it's good enough for now. Chocolate diamonds, my ass. All right. Gosh. Oh, 
el carro que estaba vida. Ahí va a bajar el carro. Thank <laughs> you.